Okay, so now we're going live. Live. It is live now. Live on YouTube. Wait, it's preparing. It's got a load screen. So it's more fun, uh, more fun and. Um, it's done. Redirecting YouTube. Let's see. Hang out on uh, in the uh, Zoom. In it's Hangout, there. if you want to load models or something like that, gadgets, you have issues. It's that. there. It's loaded. Yeah, we're on there now. Okay. Is there anybody there? See, let's give people a minute because I just I just came in and I'm I'm the only guy there. Yeah. Are you still are you still Donna um moderator on there? Uh yeah. I think so. Yeah, yeah, I got yeah, the wrench. I got the wrench. All right. I want to see it. Now we How have four watching. We have four watching. Already four? Yep. Oh. Hi, everybody. We're just, this is our, this is our first um, Ukulele webinar on Zoom. We're just kind of, we opened up the room early so that you guys would know to come in. We haven't actually started and we're just kind of, doing some things, playing around and seeing what the different views are. So hang tight. We're just going to start in just a few minutes, but we wanted to, we're probably going to start, we're going to probably open the room um, about five, 10 minutes early every day, open the YouTube stream so that, you know, so that you can see to come in because now we have no way of programming it on YouTube to announce that there's something coming. We can only announce it. It only gets announced when we go live. So this is the new uh, Zoom situation. Yeah? Okay. And now you get to see what we do before we actually go live. So everyone's going to have to um, be cognizant of their mute and unmute. Everyone has the ability to mute and unmute themselves. But we're going to do the same thing um, when you're not talking. Please stay muted. Christine, of course, is not there. <laughs> yeah. Here. Perfect, Reinhardt. So, um, I wanted to look at the YouTube myself. La, 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 la. Let's see. Hmm. So, you have the news? Do I have the news? Yes. The exopolitics news. The what? Exopolitics news. Disappointed news? No, no exopolitics. Uh, for, for some people, I think it's disappointing news. But... Oh, and it comes off as meetings. Oh, that's terrible. So we have to retitle it afterwards. It doesn't come across with the... Does it have an, a title of it on YouTube? Is there a title? Just says meeting posts, personal meeting room. We're going to have to figure out how to change that. What if I can edit that now? Edit okay. video. Oh. Yeah. See, this is, <laughs> this is I'm gonna I can change, I think I can edit the. Okay. Give it a shot. With the name of it. Hukalo. Sorry. So if anyone in the YouTube wants to come in the Zoom room, you can. Here's the yeah. information. Yep. Let's, let's, I, I put let's. it in the description in just a second. You'll see it when I save this. Let's, you have to have the Zoom. Bandwidth. But you have to have Zoom on your computer in order to do that. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh. Wait a minute. What's it saying? It won't let me do it. I probably can only do it till after. It 
It's not going to let me do it. Okay. All right. Oh, well, now it'll let me do it. I know why. Wait, I figured out why. Hmm. Well, let me post the Zoom information. Isn't that something? All right. Well, never mind. We can post it. You can post it in the. Um, you can post it in the chat, Don. Okay, I will. I've got it on my page. I saved it all. Okay. <clears throat> so, did the title change or not? It should have changed. No. It hasn't changed. I can refresh the screens. Let's just see. Yes, it changed. Perfect. We so that's the new new task then. Okay, good. It's working. All right. So hi everyone who's in this chat. Hi, Lily Pad. And there's pretty there's a pretty big delay between it's about a ten second delay. Yeah. Okay. Well I'm gonna go out of that because I don't wanna it lags me out, so Okay. So are you ready, Alex? Ready for talk? <laughs> yeah, to be the, yeah? Yeah, we'll, we'll talk. I want you to, we'll do like a little, like five five minute interview, you know? What, what are you saying, Daniel? Yeah, I know, that's because I'm the host, yeah. I referred to that message I sent you. Yeah, I can't control that. That's just the way this thing is set up. The only thing I might do is just uh, take my picture off. You know what I mean? Like I will stop my, I will stop the video. Like if I, if I stop video, then I disappear, and I might do that. That's what I'm doing for the moment. Yeah. So, oh, I'm there again. And then I'm gone again. <laughs> and so if I do that, then I will be at the top when he's talking, and that might be preferable. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, so I think we could do just like a little interview with you because people don't know you. Hey, Michelle, is the volume okay? Can you all hear me, or do you hear my fan in the background? I, we hear you. I, hear you. I can hear you, yeah. Yeah, but can you hear me well and clearly, or is my fan? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Your, your sound is good. Well. <clears throat> okay. No fan at all. Cool. You see it moving right there. And it's on turned on high, so it's quite loud for me. <laughs> yeah. Can you hear me, though? 15. I can yeah. hear you. Yeah. Yeah. So, so welcome. So we, we might as well just start now, then. Everyone ready? Okay. Hi everyone. I'm going to I'm going to make myself primary speaker here. Okay. This is my cat monkey. Just I'm not wearing a cat hat. He just likes to sit on the back of my screen. So hi uh, everyone. Yeah. Hi everyone and welcome. Uh, my name is Kara Newman and this is the Saturday Human Colony Hukula webinar. Today is the 20th of July 2019. And today is the first time that we've done a webinar streaming live from Zoom. So uh, we opened up the room a little early because some things have changed in the way the webinar will run uh, because we cannot now with YouTube post a link early. So we've decided to open up the room a few minutes early so that everyone gets a notification that we've gone live and we'll probably do that five or 10 minutes early. And so you'll see us moving around and, you know, uh, talking, taking requests and all kinds of stuff like that and just getting settled. So welcome. Um, 
Dawn is in charge of the YouTube chat. If you have any, if you want to come in Zoom and you have Zoom, you can download it, the invitation there. Alex is going to be our uh, host today. Say something, Alex. Good day to you all. <laughs> so you're going to be our, you're going to be our host. You're going to be, you're going to be teaching us a, a class on what? I don't teach. I okay. just. Um, He's going to facilitate a class on yes. what? Okay. On some topics, just surprise. And we do like a cafe talk. Yeah. Okay. So you've been a member of Human Colony since what? The beginning, haven't you? No, no, no. Like um, three oh, years ago. Oh, three years ago. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Where do you live? In uh, Romania. Okay. That, uh, by the way, that is a country in Europe, Eastern Europe, <laughs> right? Everyone knows that, yeah. Oh, uh, not everyone. <laughs> <laughs> are you are you Roma or not? What? Are you Gypsy or no? Uh, no, Gypsy are like a minority in Romania. Yeah. Okay. So. Well, you're dark, so you have a little bit of that look to you. I am what? You're you're dark. You have dark hair. No, I said I stay to the sunlight. Okay. Like uh, you go in the summer. Yeah. Yeah. Well, okay. I don't know. I don't get that. I'm not. I. You don't get born sun. So. Yeah, you don't have. The sun. <laughs> All right. So why don't we? So I'll just. I want to do this so everyone can see. So today in our room. Oh, who do we have? Where did everybody go? We've got eight people. Everyone turn their cameras on so everyone can see you for just, a, just the very beginning, please. Where did everyone go? There's Christine. Hi, Christine. Where's Dawn? There's Dawn. Where's Michelle? Don't hide from me. Anyway, also, too, because if you're not, if you, can I see you? So, sorry, people in the YouTube. We're just figuring this out. Okay, because I, I want to be able to introduce everyone in the room. So today in our room, we've got Alex. We've got Don, Reinhardt, Christine, Daniel. We have, oh, we have a lot of people. We have Maz, we have Moonlight, Rose, we have Tarek. And we had, we had Michelle, maybe she'll come back. Hi, everyone. So I just want everyone to see, because now it's going to be a little different with, yeah. We'll leave it like this for a few minutes while we're just getting started. I believe Michelle is at home. The word home. She was in this room, no? Yes, she was in the room, but her her name on the screen is Home, H O M E. Oh, it's not. She's not in there. She doesn't show then. No. But we have eleven participants, but I can only see six of you. So people don't have their cameras on. Yeah. Well, nope. I have all the names on the screen plus the uh, those that have cameras on, and they're all on in the uh, gallery view. Yeah. Okay. So, <clears throat> so for the people, but in the YouTube, right? Is it gallery view right now? Yes, it is. Okay. Sorry, everyone in YouTube. So if I six, switch it now, six. is it just me? Uh, no, at this moment I can see everybody. Okay, wait, 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 give it a second. Now it's just you. Okay. Me, it's my show. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. So why don't we start with some blessings and then we'll, we'll start. And, and oh, before we do start, I just wanna say that um, if you would like to take part in the Ascension Workshop coming up August 8th through the 10th, there's still time to register. It's in Rochester, New York. You can go to hucolo.org and you will find all the information about the, the workshop. It's 575 for uh, the entire time that includes food, it includes the classes, it includes um, the lodging. And it's always really wonderful. So Max will not be there, but Jim will be there, Angela, and some special guests. Maybe Rob Goth here, we, fingers crossed, and a lot of other wonderful people. So please check it out on hucolo.org. So who wants to do a blessing? Don, Reinhardt, if you don't have your camera on, you're going to have to type in the chat. Anyone else? Yeah, I can. Okay, um, Rose will do one. Anyone else? No? Okay. Don, why don't you start? 
Horvath și este ta și am mătură fără că și tare și așa ta. Ură mă chiar și cu așa că tare să dori să ca. Dar la mătă și este și ca și un tură așa. Și zice că ta și că ui și că ta și tu cu rută și an. Blessings. Blessings. Nice. Go ahead, Reinhard. Okay, thank you. Rose. Namaste. Namaste. Thank you. <laughs> Alex. Yes. Please introduce yourself and tell us who you are, where, what you're doing, what is your background for everyone who doesn't know you. So, um, I am in the hookah group for like three years. Um, in my life, I do advertising design, and in the free time, I like to study quantum physics and what is new. This is my short introduction. That's it? That's all? You, quantum physics in your free time? Yes. <laughs> do you have a, I mean, do you have that kind of mathematical background or are you self-taught? No, uh, self-taught. Okay. So what in quantum physics fascinates you and that you're applying to sort of your spiritual life? Because I assume that's why, are you purely interested in it for, for the spiritual aspect of it or just just quantum physics in general? Well, it is about spiritual aspect. But I know. I don't, I don't consider uh, like a spiritual aspect. Okay. It's just, uh, how should I say this? Human consciousness put, yeah. le put labels on things. Just yeah. a, an aspect of your being. Right. So if you work on that, you will grow on that. If you're not, well, it's like a muscle. If you don't exercise it, yeah. you don't uh, have the, that particularity. I understand. So today, what are you going to be facilitating for us then? Well, I have uh, something to share. Okay. Facilitate or something that I uh, teach for somebody. I don't believe in teaching. I believe just in sharing. I don't believe someone invent something. The knowledge is out there. We just need to tap in the frequency and download it. And it's up to you. Uh, to put the puzzle and uh, let's say decipher the information. So for me, the great thinkers, they just meditate and uh, use their time. Well, it's precious, their life, uh, by thinking one or two ideas for a long time. And then the information that come through, just put it on the tablet or uh, papyrus or paper. Now it's on the computer or on the cloud. So is that what we're going to do? Are we going to meditate yeah, on one thing? Like for that. A long time? Uh, I will talk about something else too, like uh, social stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more like a mixing. Um, about the cloud, it's ironically because the information come from the cloud, some cloud. So that's a joke. Okay, can can you guys hear him well enough? Perfect. Okay, good. All right. So why don't I turn it over to you, and you can you can start. I'm gonna turn my camera off so it doesn't flash back and forth. But I'm very excited to uh, hear what you have to say. No, okay. Yeah? Let's share something. Let's uh, finish with the trivialities. Well, we need to be vigilant. So we need to understand some aspects. 
of our life. So I will share. Wait. see your <laughs> screen sharing <laughs> yes yeah i have something to hide and something to show how about that well let's reveal something okay you know what i'm going to do i'm going to make you host so they can see you in the corner of the screen when you're talking you can see this now yes yeah. So this is uh, how uh, things work and uh, people uh, put efforts to believe in. This is all the props, let's say. Is it correct? I'm not seeing it. The picture is not to be seen, just uh, the file name. Yeah. Well, I stop. I try again. Okay, Alex. I'm not seeing well. Oh, we you see? There we go. Okay. Uh, now we have it. Thank you. Yes. Yes. So everything uh, in our life, it's around something like this. And it, we try to believe in, or we do, we let our, let's say, sovereignty on this a subject or, on, or a, a scenario on a story um, or an act. Did you think in the information? Yes? Mm -hmm. so. Yeah. All right. So it's about scenario, plot, focus, character, costume, decoration, effects, and music. Music can be resonant. Object can be many object. In the same manner, in this um, work very well in, let's say, um, a text of magic or um, the people um, believe if they put something or move something or have something and invest energy in that, will something will happen. It's like um, um, trigger this, their subconscious. But uh, I don't want to talk about this. Everybody knows and uh, we live in the world with many cults and uh, religions. So this uh, is uh, also for, let's say, business or theater. Everything is theater, but in business and music and everything. So this is I want to show it first. And we jump on what is um, for me like um, main thing. Um, I want to 
put in the people view the this stage uh, we have a lot of problem uh, every everybody brag about climate change but nobody are doing nothing and we must understand not uh, many people know that uh, the tree mirror uh, in fact the, our lungs so if you look at a tree uh, the corona is smaller in the one part and it's bigger in another same with the lungs so it we give carbon dioxide the tree give us oxygen right right so i'm sorry i jump it uh that was just for your consideration it was just for start uh, something that i want to share it's something that uh, i put a lot of thought in that uh, you can write seven books on that uh, for me it doesn't matter i just got idea and um, for me it's uh, sparkled just the one word vigilance for the future um, we live not on the planet. Uh, let's put it uh, this another way. You don't uh, need to look outside uh, of the planet or inside the planet. We have all the characters and all the stages uh, that what can happen in the universe between, uh, let's say, uh, conscious being. So here, locally, this is my opinion. So as a box of below. Uh, okay, that uh, the part and the uh, information you can look under quantum physics or alchemy. Um, it's another part, but I just use it for this information. You don't no need to look up. You have all the information between us and in us. Most of that is in us. And I will show that forward. But I want to make an appeal and uh, to everybody who have the patience to see this movie afterward. Uh, it's just only five bucks a tree. So buy a tree and plant it. You do much and great uh, change. Maybe you cannot see it or not uh, feel it consciously, but it will be great for the nature. Because the tree is like a is like a, is like an antenna, and the tree. Uh, let's say don't think too much but do very much not uh, giving only the oxygen but uh, also put the energy in the ground okay. Reinhard, so, can you mute yourself please sorry i, I made too much noise so it's not just uh, the oxygen that we take from tree or plants. We have more advantages. And um, I will share uh, something later about another advantage about the tree. Some people see... Can you go back to your picture so we can see you talking? Or do you want this video, do you want this slide still up on the screen? No, no, no. I want to be relaxed and uh, talk about it and I'll let it on the screen. Thank you very much. I'm not used to it with the... Um... I know, but I think for people staring at this, this is, I don't know if it's... What? It'd be better if they can see you. No, it's better if uh, they okay. understand this message. Okay, no problem. Go ahead. Uh, 
very important. So the tree is the mirror of the lungs. You give the dioxide, carbon dioxide, he give you the oxygen. This is how life works in this matter. Question about this? No. No. Now, let's. I want to see if uh, the oh, we have the whiteboard. You need to turn your camera on because we have nothing now from you. Yeah. Uh, oh, I don't have a whiteboard. Yes. There we go. We have, we have the a whiteboard. No. Do you have the whiteboard? No. I don't know. In the share, it just has. <clears throat> I mean, it, it's up to you. I, I just have find basic. You, if you go to basic, then you have whiteboard. Okay. Let's see. coming up not yet it's a little in mode mm. Mm. so it's there but it's slow i think Trying. Oh, and for everyone, everyone watching, we're still getting used to the Zoom. So, yeah. Do you see now this? What do you see? Oh, I just see a blank white thing. Maybe you have to stop your video for, again. And then it comes up. No? If you do the white. Now, stop your video and see if it. There it is. Great. Right. Okay. Rainbow. Perfect. Yay. Uh, well, <laughs> rainbow, yes, of course. So let's say um, this is um, the light MFA spectrum. Um, and uh, what is uh, our, uh, let's say, system work? All right? Mm -hmm. So if uh, let's talk about uh, chakras now right so we have uh, red orange all the rainbow but it's a different different uh, the difference between person and uh, how their system works it's particular by this and I make uh, this picture. I don't know if you see it. I will zoom in. You see it? This um, pixelation. Is that yeah, your yeah. fingerprint? No, no, it's not my fingerprint. You zoom in on the screen. Yeah, yes. you can. You can see this wave, that wave. Mm -hmm. Yes. What? Uh, uh, this is an effect in the Photoshop. So. Looks like a uh, fingerprint. Yeah, it is, but what I want to show you is not a fingerprint. Is that all that uh, our life um, 
is in this spectrum of light. Yes, uh, it's uh, something missing here. So, like, uh, it's way, but let's see in this. These waves are the magnetic, uh, let's say, um, um, they, they are magnetic, and between them, they are, um, in the, um, have a set of frequency and also information that is in the cache where we call it space, but also this spectrum you will find inside the uh, individual at the same, uh, at the, um, let's say, how do I say this? In dimension are density. So let's, if uh, this works, I don't know why we use my computer. It becomes brighter now? Is brighter? Uh, no. Do you see brighter? Do you see? No. It's, no? It's, it hasn't changed. No. It doesn't, no? Okay, so. In the dimension, let's say this is uh, the third dimension. If this is brighter, it's less denser. If it is uh, uh, in a dim color, it's uh, heavier. And by heavier for the lighter, uh, say magnetical or gravitation. So this is, uh, and by this, uh, let's say density, um, as an individual will have, um, let's say some behavior and um, the behavior is done by the information that is uh, absorbed or uh, let's say learn and some of information it is um, let's say uh, projected but um, it comes from other sources through this um, um, spectrum of light. So, well, do you have questions on that? No. no. That's interesting. <laughs> I don't have questions about it. Okay. Now I will show you something fun. But I have I don't have a whiteboard. I will try to do something else. Let's see. Uh, no more. So I'm not used to this. I have a big emotion, so I'm sorry for that. So, you see my paint now? It's there. We see the um, the spectrum now. The yeah. light. Okay. Let me show you something funny. What you don't know. So this is, is a, a light spectrum and uh, electromagnetic. Uh, let's say the the that wave are electromagnetic. Yes, and between them are um, um, information. Mm -hmm. So. Um, now I will show you how, um, let's say, an extraterrestrial being, advanced being, 
uh, see us. That's how they see us. No, no, no. I will show you how. Oh, okay. Mama. How do you know they see us this way? Well, I will give you the, the geography. Okay, I don't know why. So let's say um, one individual mm -hmm. have um, this this information. Um, so it's here a point in this spectrum in here let's say here here this is an even individual so uh, All this sum uh, of information, and remember that in this particular point are electromagnetic fields that contain some information, right? And by that, the individual can access, or let's say, resonate, and he will attract um, situation in this life and let's say he have a friend or she have a friend and uh, i'm sorry i don't know why oh, okay now it's working and she have let's say this here 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 right so very close, very, very close, but information is different because uh, that information between magnetic fields, but they are very close and so they attract each other. And this is how the alien and advanced being see us, but they don't see us like a physical, a person, but how uh, is our cluster of, um, let's say, information and uh, resonance? Did you get it? Yeah, that's interesting. So that's one person, right? No, uh, that was the black. Uh, it didn't work. It's a, it's an individual. Yes. Yes. And uh, with the white, it's, uh, let's say, um, his girlfriend. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So they, they, uh, they, they too uh, are um, like a cluster. We can add more. Yes. Yeah. Well, so this different individual have um, different information in this spectrum of light and access uh, different, um, and sometimes they are very close, but it's not the same. So, because uh, everybody in own right and uh, being mm -hmm. uh, decide what to do with the information. Mm -hmm. and they, they don't translate it like uh, true how it's coming. So, mm. Of course, in, in our world, uh, this pollution, electro smoke, and a lot of stuff. 
now it's uh, 5G. We're going better and better. <laughs> So, so are you are you, a, do you are you supportive of 5G or not? Uh, no, I'm not. Uh, I I hear uh, some advantages, but I'm not. I'm Why not? not? Uh, well, not uh, not all the people do the Tai Chi or let's see. Qigong, yeah, mm -hmm. to develop the uh, stronger magnetic field, yeah, right, to protect that. So, for um, I will, I will, how do I say, people are um, not lazy, well, uh, sedentary, sedentary, uh, how do I think that? Sedentary, um, yeah, sedentary, right, right. So, so too many people are sedentary. So, no, for sedentary people, for kids. That yeah. will be like a genocide, you know? Yeah, slow genocide. That depends where the antenna is, right? So do you, I mean, do you honestly think they're going to release 5G and people are just going to start dropping dead? No. No, I don't think so either. No. It might be like... A, At some moment, mm -hmm. the Wi-Fi wi didn't uh, have an effect, right? Right. But later we understand that affect the climate in some in some manner, and not only the climate. So we'll see. It's a matter of the resonance. Yeah. They understand. So. Uh, if you put your uh, fingers on the cables in the, how do I say, electricity, right? Mm -hmm. That 60 hertz frequency will fry. But are some frequency that give you electricity, but it can uh, don't uh, fry you, or even you can go with the light bulb in the in the swimming pool, and he will not. Uh, blow up or uh, have uh, effects, side effects, like they do right now in um, electricity that we have. Um, do you have headphones? Yes. Can you put them on because your your sound is getting a little bit boomy. 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 Now it's okay. No. Uh, my mic is uh, incorporated in the laptop. I'm I know, sure. but can you, do you have like earbuds you can wear or not? I have uh, the... Oh, you have them on. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm. All right. It's a little boomy. Yeah. Maybe get closer. When you move away, I, it's very hard for me to hear you. So you have to sit still. Well, <laughs> okay. Maybe I speak uh, slow. Uh, oh, it's not about slowing. Not, it's not so loud. No, it's not about, oh, I think your speaking is fine. It's just it's booming but that's okay it's okay is there if everyone else can understand everything that's fine so 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 with the so with the resonance so people who are doing things like tai chi have a sort of resilience is that what it is that are people who are more centered in their energy well i can talk about this um if um uh, I answer in in your uh, for your question. Yeah. It's a so uh, the physical the, uh, human body can develop um, some energies, yes. Mm -hmm. And um, if you want to get better, you need to develop your electromagnetic field. Yes, this is basic. Uh, then is uh, Shen, mm -hmm. uh, which uh, is developed in your kidneys and give you uh, that uh, particular, uh, let's say, not substance. But in time, uh, chemically, if you behave and you don't 
abuse yourself, develop another substance, become something else, and that energy can sustain your life long, uh, your body longer. You don't get uh, ag, mm -hmm. and you have electricity in your body. So mm -hmm. there are many. I don't want to talk about right I now. I, just, I can make. I, I can make. Uh, uh, and I share uh, another time uh, okay. alchemy course on that. Okay. And we can talk about that. Sure. Okay. Well, let's but, uh, Yes. Main thing is they do. Uh, it is. Yeah. Este uh, in Romanian uh, means it is. So uh, main thing, uh, yes, do the qigong, uh, tai chi, mm -hmm. and uh, you you will be better on uh, this uh, matter, like uh, electromagnetic uh, radiation, um, psychic attack, uh, and many things. Okay. Not only in number one reality, but uh, in number zero reality in four dimensions. So, well, okay. That is for now. On okay. that. Thank you. Something. <laughs> so this is how, um, let's say, uh, this uh, sharing, and uh, I uh, um, take this uh, picture for example because uh, give a three D little effect, but it's though it's two D. So um, they can see it's 3D and how many things vibrate and uh, all that music and uh, that painting is beautiful. So mm -hmm. how they see it. This is a share from Sasani people. Uh, mm -hmm. They see us. They don't see us like individual. They are like, uh, okay, who are you? Well, what is your credential? And your credential are your frequencies and your people around you and how their spectrum of light is uh, congruent with yours and what you develop like a group something mm. like that so okay um that is uh, where i have the information well let's talk about now Consciousness. So now I have it set up um, where, well, you can't see all of us, but can you? There, now you can see all of us. One moment, please. So now I will show you some a chart and each one of you, including me and everybody that will see this movie, it will know if it seems sincerely enough with self, it will know where is it. On a scale of, let's say, um, anatomy of consciousness. Can you see it? No, it's it's coming though. Oh, 
Okay. It's on? Yeah, it's on there. Yeah? Yeah. Well, so this is the, um, a study by um, David Hawking. Who was it? David Hawking. No, I just said, oh, it, oh, was it? Not who was it, but oh, like, oh, oh. was it? <laughs> yes, and he writes a book. Uh, the name of the book is Power Versus Force. Mm -hmm. So. Did he do the emotional scale there or? Yes, did he... this is all about. Okay. Anatomy of consciousness. Mm -hmm. So. So below twenty two hundred are all levels are destructive of life and both the individual and society a large all level above 200 are constructive expression of power i can't so, hear anything you're saying so now we can back a little bit hello there perfect don't stay right there so all level below 200 are destructive of life in both the individual and society at large all level above 200 are constructive expression of power now, in the book, it's about power versus uh, so force versus power. So, well, everybody thinks that uh, in our life, let's say, some people are looking for power, but they uh, truly only uh, are looking for force. Um, how it uh, that explain in the book is that in any situation uh, you remember the first picture that I show yeah it's the act of magic and code mm -hmm. illusion yes so in the first we have a plot someone needs to blame not me I'm more uh, smart. I'm too, I don't know, right? Right. Oh, that is sport. Some, uh, we need to go there to um, We need to go in Africa and um, build some homes for people. Mm, no, we, we don't see that <laughs> right now. <laughs> it's a uh, Prospection for golden diamond or something. Yeah. If you, I don't want to go in politics or something like that. But so, and this on this scale, uh, upon the twenty to one thousand, uh, are many many levels. Do you uh, do you can see my paper in the left? No. No. So. I will write, uh, I will read. So on the, uh, oh, it, it, it's on the picture also. But uh, you don't see, I will write, uh, I will read, excuse me. So uh, I will share this paper afterwards. I will put a link. Okay. So on the 20, uh, it's a, it's a shame there, but in the uh, process, it's elimination, in emotion, it's humiliation, in life view, it's miserable, in God view, it's despising. On the third, uh, 30 level, it's um, um, guilt, destruction, blame, evil, and vindication. Yeah. On the 50 is abdication, despair, hopelessness, and condemning. 
on the 75 uh, despond despondency the regret uh, something tragic or, or this painful at 100 where it's more people on this planet is the fear as is punitive as frightening anxiety and withdraw and 125 desire denying disappointing craving and enslavement and 115 anger vengeful antagonistic hateful and aggression mm -hmm. and 175 is pride the indifference demanding corn and inflation and 200 that is the uh, above, uh, 200 and above, is courage, permitting, feasible affirmation and empowerment. 250 is neutrality, enabling, satisfactory, trust, and release. Mm. That is important um, yeah. meditation because um, you release all that is below 200 and you can do that in the 30 days okay. 210 210 willingness inspiring hopeful optimist and intention and uh, 250 acceptance merciful harmonious forgiveness and transcendence and 400 is the reason why meaningful understanding and abstraction and 500 love loving being reverence and revelation uh, now we can see uh, the saints or um, they were in the this um, uh, or above of uh, 500 like uh, love loving uh, was the a state of being, yeah, you feel that love, that vibration, it's in all your um, nature, or let's say in your space between the atoms, light and uh, vibration of love. In that uh, state, you have the revelation. And uh, 540, uh, a joy, you have the uh, let's say your consciousness become one you know, become complete have serenity and transfiguration at 600 you have peace all being you feel mm -hmm. all beings around you in here they see um, they explain it as being perfect an emotion you have only bliss and the process is illumination uh, 701,000, it is an alignment, uh, God view itself, life view is, emotion is stable, ineffable, and process is pure consciousness. So, these are all the levels of consciousness that Mr. David Hawkins do the research and uh, let us know how we do in our course spiritual life that aspect that um, it should be for all the people like um, i need to have my uh, meal or i need to have to sleep a little bit uh, one hour to that part to let's say it's spiritual yeah questions well i would share yeah this. i'm just watching i'm looking at it and i'm i'm also thinking about it in tantra in in kashmir shaivism they talk about concealing and revealing grace that that you're always in some sort of you're either you're either in your spiritual self or more in your you know, in your lower self. And, and I was just looking at this also in that, in of that, course. that sense. 
And I was also looking at from the aspect of sound because the light frequency will also correlate to musical notes and sound. What about? Well, if you're, because this obviously is, is a chart talking about raising frequency. I mean, you, it's telling you what the frequencies are, right? Based on- no, Yeah, yeah, I, I don't take it by the chart of the, let's say chakras, yes? No, that's it, not what I'm talking about. It, it is a process that you, um, okay. Let I'm not talking about chakras. I'm talking about emotional moods and also mindset, state of being, worldview. Yeah. And through but, meditation and sound, yeah. it's about raising your vibration. Of course, but um, if you do not practice, you you go up on the tree and you get down on the tree. Exactly. But um, let me tell you something. That mm. is why we have uh, uh, poor food or something like that. And it's a lot about uh, Tamil is to blame. We have uh, chemicals in our food. They say we have, uh, we have to uh, make more food because you are a lot of people. So... I don't believe in that because I know it's a technology. You don't need to put chemicals on food to protect it for bugs or something like that. You can uh, use some oxides. You know what is uh, oxide? Mm -hmm. yeah, something? Yes. It's not uh, detrimental for, uh, let's say, copper, copper oxide. It's not as detrimental for a plant. Uh, actually, it will grow bigger and healthier and no bugs will attack the plant or the tree if you put around it um, a little copper oxide, but that is not the discussion for today. Uh, okay, we have chemicals in the food, we have chemicals in the air. How do you expect to understand that, is not you can in general, it's a process to reintegrate your spiritual self in this body, in the physical body. Mm -hmm. It is in time that uh, all the um, uh, endocrine glands, yes, yeah, secret, uh, secret, uh, um, how do you say, develop a substance, yes, that mm -hmm. is good in the body. But if you cherish it and you have take care of your body and you don't eat meat and um, you don't eat a food that is with chemicals, mm -hmm. that substance it will transform itself naturally in something else. And by that, you go up on this ladder. But if you are, let's say, in the love state, enjoy, and you eat uh, a beef, yes? Mm -hmm. You go like... Uh, down to 200 maybe i don't know 175 for a couple of days if you do that regularly one week well you will stay down in the tree and then we we'll you will pick up the frequency that is in that domain yes right in number one reality and what is it and what is in the astral also, in the fourth dimension, right? Mm -hmm. uh, another thing I will share it. If you don't raise enough and uh, get uh, healthy and cherish your body, if you are, let's say, 400, 600, you cannot see the fifth dimension. The fifth dimensional uh, the, are exist the beings like us. Uh, they have, uh, not like us, they have physical body. But you cannot see it. You cannot see their object, their, let's say, technology or uh, a simple bread bag. You cannot see it. If your third dimensional bread goes in the 
fifth dimensional bag, <laughs> your bread in your perception will disappear like magic. But it's not magic. It's just uh, uh, frequency, band and frequency domain and uh, the amino acids of your, or of your brain is not that quality of excellence to perceive the fifth dimensional people or object. So, so, so you're saying if we are able to raise our frequency, then we'll be able to see. Yes, but not with brainwave frequency. That is like. A, no, I mean with with spiritual frequency. No, 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 no. Uh, naturally, uh, you can. Let me finish. If you do it with uh, brainwave frequency <clears throat> or other technologies, it's just like a. You smoke a pot, you know, you have the experience and after that it's done. You cannot go there. Only if you are good, let's say practitioner and remember that frequency and you can have fun again. But if you don't not, uh, not build in your body uh, the, that substance, yes, that naturally body will create for you, but you need to have um, a good food mm -hmm. um, and food that amplify, amplify and uh, uplift you, not uh, put you down. But now, well, it's contradiction because <clears throat> I have a um, discussion other other formers and uh, um, they say, um, well, ground more, yes. So you need to have a balance in, in this. So you, you cannot go up from, let's say, 125, yes, there mm -hmm. is desire. <laughs> and people with desire will do crazy things, yes. Yeah. Uh, from desire. To one thousand, oh, one thousand, yes, no. You can have the glimpse. They, uh, there are um, technologies to do that, but they cannot remain there because the body is not used to it. It's simple like that. Um, if you go. Um, how do I say? People that are working the mine or something like that, yes? Mm -hmm. If they go with the elevator in 1,000 meters inside the mountain, yes? For them, in time, they develop the, the their body is used to that uh, frequency domain and everything, all the, that energy that is there, yes? Mm -hmm. And for the specific uh, place, that specific energy is not the same. Well, if you go now, let's say like a tourist, I want to see that mind, that mind, you have problems with your lungs, with your um, consciousness. Um, you become de delusional because now maybe I will share more. In our, um, our planet, we are outside, like uh, we see bacteria on the, our skin, yes? But inside the, the, the earth, yes? Mm -hmm. uh, inside, it is the etheric field and etheric zone. In that etheric zone, we, hear, um, we have uh, on our planet um, population and some city, like in stories, you know? Mm -hmm. Um, some channelings on YouTube um, are from the people on that zone. So if you go there and you are not, uh, you're not used to it, your mind is not used to it. Right. Uh, first of all, your technology, uh, whatever you have, <laughs> GPS will not work there. Uh, 
whatever technology from our um, reality in that reality it will not work because it's a um, technology for that spectrum of the frequency and if you go down to the center of the earth which is a black hole well you lose it very very much right so this is not something that you take a pill like in the fast food it, uh, you you become pro progressive i'm not a very good of this but i uh, when i discovered this uh, first of all i discovered this diagram and after that uh, i discovered the book so i didn't know what is it from but uh, i accept that this tree and i i observe myself by what I pick up from the street, you know, you go in the metro, people, uh, energy, you exchange energy because you cannot be very, uh, how do I say, uh, in integrity. You cannot. Um, <laughs> you need a lot of work. So we, we must learn to give more. So, yeah. Uh, well, I, I observe on that where the where is my level. So it's very <laughs> beautiful and fun that we have. Um, this is uh, very it's like in two hundred and uh, two thousand and three the book. But you know, if you don't uh, put your mind on that on that frequency, I need that or the book will not appear. So well, that's it. I will um, upload this, or I give the link to to download the PDF, and I okay. incorporate the diagram also. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So, what I want to share now? Okay, uh, some meditation exercise. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Okay. Okay. Exercise. Let's do something practical. Okay. Pala 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 all day talking so yes. okay the base of um I will show you the base and the. Um, oh, and um, there's a question from the YouTube chat from Lilypad. Lilypad. Yeah. Lily yeah. yeah. She wants to know: Does uh, medicine change the frequency? Medicine? What medicine? <laughs> well, uh, medication like. Uh, Prozac. Several medications can. Yes, Prozac. You will go down fast. I know the Prozac is in America, like... Uh, it's not just America. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> I hear a lot in all one the... In, one in three people in France is on med medication. Do you know that? Yeah, it's tragic. I cannot uh, comment on that. You know, that if... Uh, how do I say? If the people don't... <laughs> Let me put it uh, another way. Okay. If the child don't cry, the mother will not feed the child because mm -hmm. she thinks she thinks he's not hungry, right? Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> it's simple. The people, if uh, the people don't ask and don't look, only demand stuff. Well. It's not up to you what you demand food. Okay, that is your food. Go to the store. What quality it is? You don't. It doesn't matter. You just eat it, take it. It is good. Uh, it's flavor. It's a flavor bomb. Yeah. Well, you need to see it 
differently. What is made? Who is doing that food? What is in the food? Maybe you have a friend who have a little laboratory of chemistry. Test the food. See what is in it. Well, I um, about medicine. I don't know what about medicine she talks about. There's a lot of medicine, uh, allopant medicine, like uh, you know, pills. They are ecstasy pills. They are medicine like uh, um, marijuana, right? Mm -hmm. But uh, the is. Can we? If someone use this, um, let's let's talk about marijuana. It was a joke. I was see on internet a couple of days ago, people in Himalaya uh, grow and plant uh, marijuana and do business with that. No, people in Himalaya with uh, some height don't need to plant that, it's everywhere. <laughs> that is a joke. So it's everywhere. And there is two branches. It's sativa and indica. Sativa give you energy and amplify you. And indica is more uh, like shamanic work going down on the tree, right? Mm -hmm. So it's, it will slow all your uh, motor factors and your uh, brain transmission. Basically, lower your frequency. So, on your uh, feet, at the base of the feet, you have like one hertz. On the um, on the back, you have portion of your um, with different frequency, like one hundred to three hundred and. 40 hertz or something like that. I don't have the chart right now. But uh, everything and every organ have a frequency. You don't need to use it just for fun. You can make medicine with that, about marijuana, but uh, if it's legal in your state, uh, I'm not pro uh, the pills. There are other... Um, let's say, gadgets right now that treat with resonance, uh, like almost everything. So I will talk about something that, that is very gravitational and darky, like a tumor or something like that. What it does in the human body, if the body is weak, it, develop the, let's say, personal electromagnetic field and uh, take the nourishment from the body and uh, the body cannot fight with the uh, tumor because it's weak or that organ is weak where the tumor is. So what the doctors should do, is apply a frequency outside the body, directly to the tumor, frequency bigger than the frequency of the tumor. And after that, the resonance will become different and uh, the tumor will be consumed by the, how do I say, um, the body, not coming right now. Immun uh, immunitary system or something like that? Yes. Immune system would eat that tumor because you will lose the frequency. Will, the body will have a bigger frequency and it becomes stronger, stronger and then can uh, destroy the tumor. This is uh, a little example. Or 
Are, are they doing that anywhere? I, I, you know, I had, um, I had a tumor in my stomach and they hit it with uh, sound waves. Yes. And it heated it, heated it up. And yes. over time it got smaller because it healed it. Because the, because the your, your it, system, it, will, will, it will eat it. It will yeah. be Yes. Yeah, that's what I had done. It's called, yeah. they're doing that with tumors yeah. now. Yes, yes, yes. You need just to, to, not to despair. If you have a problem, just look and uh, don't lose the, let's say, the hope. But uh, yeah. open your eyes and uh, look for it because nobody will give you something. Yeah. Uh, maybe you, you get help, but nobody will... Uh, let's say you have a problem and somebody on the street come at your door and hello yes how are you my name is john yes i'm larry larry you have a problem there and yeah. you need to use that no nobody will do that no yes let's okay. let's go with the meditation yeah yeah okay we do meditation and, awesome. uh, questions let's see if we have i don't think so we have it no no, any questions? Anyone? No. Okay. Sorry. So, what I should now? Do a meditation. No. Uh, first of all, we learn something. We learn the secret of yoga. Do you the secret of yoga? The main branch from the that this branch everything what is yoga uh, being like uh, many school but this was the main thing so very simple stuff but uh, anyway, very powerful can you see it Coming. Okay. Yes. Okay, the oh. mudras, yeah. Yes, this is the mudras for cleansing the five elements in the body. Yes. Water, earth, water, fire, air, and the space, the ether, or akash. Mm -hmm. Yes? Yes. These are the mudras. Um, if you do this every day, like exercise like 20 minutes you become healthier and you will have a word um, let's say charge in your life and uh, later you can have uh, many many other gifts let's say so um, how you practice this Okay. Yeah. So it's first is the number five, four, three, two, and one. Not from one to five. Okay. It's from five to one. Okay. So first is earth. It's not. Hold your hand in front of your face so they can see it in the camera. Okay, sorry. Uh, yes. Uh, let me see. Yeah. Earth. Can you see it? Uh, yeah. So this is Earth, is Na. Second is water. Ma. Fire is She. Air is Va. And it is Ya. It is. It is Nama Shiva. Yeah. Om Nama Shivaya. If you want with Om. Five. It, it, Shiv. There are five. <laughs> Nama Shivaya. Yeah. Yeah, I know that. And it's and it's and I, I'm gonna help the pronunciation of this. It's uh it's uh Jana Varuna. Priti, 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 
It's a Prithvi and then Varuna, Jala, Akash, and Shuna. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but the mantra is Om Na is Nama Shivaya. That yes. Om Nama Shivaya. Om Nama Shivaya. Exactly. And actually, that's the Vedic form. That's the way I'm saying it. Is the Vedic form of the chant. Okay. So this is the uh, the first um, practice of yoga, uh, mm -hmm. and it, it is the oldest. Mm -hmm. uh, the purification of five elements. Yes. If you don't have this, you uh, let <laughs> we go to the chart. We we stay like 150. We cannot go up. We can have the glimpse of joy, something like, but we don't stay at that that level. So this is the meditation, um, uh, the mudras, and the meditation is you name your chakra, chakras like uh, lam, and you you do the mudra. Say lam and do then the, you uh, on the lam down on the sacral chakra yes root chakra excuse mm -hmm. me yes you cleanse everything there but you pronounce the the chakra um, name name yes lam. and you're not doing the you wouldn't do like lam om namah or om no 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 no, no you don't I say om namah shivaya no I say just lam and do the mudras uh, okay. I do with the uh, both both hands. Uh, I I saw people that I they do only with the right, but uh, I'm stereo, so I use both hands. Okay, I'm surprised you're not doing with pranayama. No, mm, not uh, because uh, I want that my fire to be okay. If I have a lot of fire or much fire, I'll blow that fire. I have a girlfriend or partner of life. So this is natural. I don't need to boost. Oh. Uh, pranayama is not for everybody. You need to uh, to to have, um, let's say, time, uh, what you eat. You, you go on the re regime. Or, regime, uh, yeah. Yeah, regime and stuff like that. So I'm not so... For my, for, I have to do pranayama twenty minutes every day, so I, it's why. Well, what that if that works for you, okay. I don't go. Uh, for me, it's a little extreme to go that. Uh, okay. Go there. Okay. So, so why don't you do you this? Can simple help, I, I, I like to inhale naturally. Yeah. And, uh, do, but that's not uh, hardcore yoga. Yeah, no. do it slow. Yeah, slow, yes. But yeah. not uh, pranayama. No, 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 no. I meant the hand symbols. Do the hand oh. signals again yeah. slow. Yeah. So you have the lam, vam, ram, yam, ham, om, aum. Yes, when you pronounce the chakra, let's say uh, lam, lam, you do lam. You're going five, um, one, four, three. Three is the like, what is it? How does what is the order? Five. Yes, it's five, four, three, two, one. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Yeah. It's okay. earth. Prim primordial. Yes. Earth. Yeah. Water, fire, right. air, and ether, space. And and you do it with right hand, left hand, both hands, just one both hand. Both hands, because um, they represent in every aspect of this. Yes, from the five to one, mm -hmm. you have uh, magnetics inside, right? So uh, you have magnetic, and you are uh, also gravitational and energies, right? Right. So I like to do both. Both. Maybe some moment I will discover something else, but 
some some people who who teach this, I don't teach it. I just share it. Right. Um, do with the right hand, but um, well, everybody takes what they work for them. Okay. Okay. Did you get it? I will share also all the all the stuff. I do just. I'm gonna do one hand. I think I'll do both hands. Go ahead. All right. Both hands. Uh, okay. So both hands is uh, it's now. If you want to remember it, it, first of all, you you need to to uh, know how to pronounce. So earth is na na. Water is ma. <sighs> Na na, she is fire. Va is air. Uh, and Akash is uh, yeah. Uh, air is um, va. Va. So did you hear about vimana? Ne? Yes. Yes. I think it's fun in the uh, um, ancient language because everything is. Well, this is Sanskrit, so yes, in Sanskrit. So, um, in Vede, Vimana was the object who fly in the sky. Ramana, so, yeah. There is Va, so Vimana. So from the five to one. Okay. Five. Hmm. Mm. You can uh, look in the Chinese uh, Chinese Taoist uh, system. You will find you will find the. I think uh, it's a neagram or something on the five elements. Mm -hmm. It's uh, the same, but uh, this mudra. What is the mudra? Mudra is uh, like a contact, you know. You have the supercomputer and you push the buttons. And on the hand, every part of the hand is like a, a zone, is like a button. If you know the codes, you activate something in you. A particularity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's not magic, it's mechanics, it's physics, and it's like chemistry. So Okay. But mudras are contacts, yes. Yeah. So, with uh, with if you uh, use mudras and mantras, it's very very. Uh, you could do Om Namah Shivaya with it. You could because it anchors also that you re it's saying the same but different. But uh, go ahead anyway. Uh, om, um, it's the. Not Om, but the Namah Shivaya. You could be like. Om da 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 da. You know, one, two, three, four, five, whatever. Yes, but it, when you practice on the chakras, yeah, Om you use on the um, head chakra. So I share it how I learn it. Okay. So you do what you do. <laughs> you do what you need to do. All right. Thank you. So okay. You can play with it. Yeah. So. Okay. Okay. And uh, because everything is uh, have reason, I will share with you something that um, you will make a very precious friend. And also will help you in many aspects, but I will not open your present for that. It's not me. So, these are meditation in Taoistic um, cold. Um, mm. Can you okay. zoom that in? What? Can you zoom it or can you make it bigger? Or? No, you can see it. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Um, you can do it sitting or in the on the foot. 
or like um, yogi do like buddha uh, goes to the tree <clears throat> so the tree is very good uh, friend because he can rise if you let's uh, look at this um, left and down yes and uh, the people is on the on the feet yes yeah so if you here it um, to visualize that your energy is coming out from the top of your head as bright white light that that's on the top of the tree and come down and um, come inside you again but uh, if you use um, in the opposite um, direction coming down from your feet walking up in the tree and coming down uh, what uh, this exercise does without fears or other things you will rise in frequency and also um, you will perceive better the fourth dimension um, another gift that coming with that i cannot talk about that but because they are um, for very realist people that are very uh, good stories and uh, well if you do it you will know it so or simply black, black, place your back to the tree as you meditate or do and this meditation is okay um, in the right uh, down like buddha did you can uh, it's, uh, it's better to have uh, outside the water or something and um, if you listen um, the water at some moment you you have the capacity to to go astrally and um, the water and the the energy of the tree which is grounded and also bringing up and down energy uh, from him to you in nature that um, let's say dance of electromagnetics and with the water will um, teach your consciousness very fast how to uh, access the four dimension and uh, lucid dreaming also so you can try it's very okay and uh, <clears throat> And also uh, for the light workers, you can, uh, let's say, wake up uh, the tree and uh, put the code uh, in the tree, the code that you have. And uh, the tree, they are very communicative, a very large distance, because they have. Um, uh, um, down in on the roots, they have the that spore of like a fungus, and uh, that fungus um, takes something from the tree, like substances, uh, and also the fungus facilitates the communication. So, uh, can you you can find this on the scientists discover that like yeah. two weeks ago. Oh. It's all videos now about the whole. Oh, okay, so so it is done by the science. Mm -hmm. It's not something story. Yeah. It's talk story. You know, I have a, I have a good relationship with two trees on my street. I I communicated with them already almost every single day for almost fifteen years. I greet them every time I walk by them. Um, I communicate with them. And then when I need healing, I will go and lean up against the tree. 
you know. And sometimes they invite me when I'm feeling bad or when I have stress or whatever. Yeah, they they're, they're very, very you, you go kind. Uh, basically, you you leave your baggage in there. Yeah. And they, they help you to with. Uh, yeah, but I have two, there's two trees or twin, twin trees. They kind of grow like this, but they're right next to each other. So one tree, one's uh, leaves are, and branches are going this way and the other ones are going that way. And I've just talked to them since, since I've lived here. They have names and I greet them every day, every day when I'm walking, sometimes several times a day. And so, and there are many times where I go and lean on them or touch them or just connect to them mm. mentally. Yeah. So also I can, um, um, if you have, um, let's say you don't feel uh, okay um, because you go outside in the city and there are metals and stuff like that, um, concrete, um, steel and um, a lot of uh, electro smoke, which uh, you um, you pick up from the environment the, yeah. the static energy. Do you know what is static energy? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so static energy is not so good for the body. No. So if you have the tree, it's better you go there, and uh, if you are don't have a problem to put your feet on the ground, like take your shoes out yeah well if you put the hands on the tree the, it will help you it, it will channel that energy that um, static energy in the ground for you right if you you don't have tree let's say you are in the block in apartment right well <clears throat> you uh, open the water in the bathroom and let the upper uh, the water uh, like 30 seconds one minute till mm -hmm. get outside in the main uh, how do i say pipe which is metal that is in the ground mm -hmm. and uh, if you go and you put your foot in that water in your bathroom or in yes bathroom um, you, that energy will go down in the in the ground also. Yeah. So, so people don't know they um, they get sick. I have a headache, or I have a, I don't know my stomach, or whatever. But uh, you need to learn, not only to take. Well, well the I mean, the elements are there for there. You can. You can symbolize the elements as well, the water. I mean, you can symbolize all of it. And I, know. I speak about uh, energies that you, you pick up on, from the street. Yeah. Like static energy. Static energy is not okay for your body. So, no, no, no. What I'm saying is for the elements where you're wanting to ground into them, like water or earth, yes. you can right. do that. Yeah. A main thing for the people, majority, they don't uh, know how to give they know how to take yeah so it's important to learn how to give also that is why uh, many many wise men uh, talk about this learn how to give also because uh, first of all you give for you from it for you for your uh, health if you don't give that energy you will not go you right. will take and take and take and go extreme in your health hazard that is why people have problem uh, health problem because they uh, crystallize that emotion bad emotion so whatever they, let's put a label on that um, or a situation in life that they don't like they always remember that why why you have to go with the luggage from the mountain to the sea so leave it somewhere. Yes. So that is from me today. Um, 
next time we talk alchemy. I will present something, okay. and the people can make that home. And uh, well, everybody can experiment on their behalf. Would you like to lead us in a meditation before we go? Let me think of something. Yeah, Don, I agree with what you're saying. Don made the comment. He said he used uh, the meditation. He visualizes a tree, a specific tree that he knows. Yeah, let's do this. Mm, so everybody get a little lift up. Uh, well, close your eyes. Okay. First of all, I'll do a little meditation for re realization. So close your eyes. Inhale deeply in your body, in your body. Now you can hear your personal voice in your head. You can hear outside your house, inside your house. You have a lot of noise. Thought process, memory, and the simple question is, who is observing this? And the answer is you. All that what you hear, see, is just made by you. Of course, in co-production with the other being around you. The, this is meditation for realization. Who are you? You are the observer. The consciousness is um, just um, a tool created. In the mind. Okay, now let's do a meditation for rising vibration. Inhale deeply. Put your attention on the tip of your down of, or down of your feet. If you are in the building or in the block, the energy will go down, down, flat on the earth, in contact with us. Now there, from there, you take the energy of the earth, that is, Mustard color, let's say it is like gold color, and take it to your feet to the first chakra. You touch the first chakra, now go up, red, now orange, go up, it's yellow, go up. green. Go up, Lucian. Go up, the ocean. Go up, red and white. Inhale deeply. Now, contract your coccyx. And expel, open your crown chakra like a fan, like a flower. Come the light. 
kamu bodoh. Memang kita jemaah. every space between all the my Well, that's it. Remember and practice every day. Thank you. You are welcome. All right. So, thank you very much for your sharing. Next time I we'll talk you. about alchemy. I thank you for your experience and um, allow me to share. Um, I have a great um, emotion to the start. So it takes a step for me to get used to this. So thank you very much. Thank you very much. And for everyone watching, thank you. This has been a Yukalo Saturday webinar. Thank you very much to Alex and to Dawn. Reinhardt, it's nice to see the other people that have been here in the room. And next week we'll be back with Jim. Mm -hmm. And we'll see you next time. Much love to everyone. Uh, have announcement. Do you have an announcement? The only announcement is about the uh, the upcoming Hukolo uh, Ascension Workshop coming up August eighth through the twelfth. So if you have if you have interest in that, please go to hukolo.org. Okay, much love to everyone. Thank you. Let's stay. Oh, now how do I stop? <laughs> how do we stop the stream? From YouTube. You need to be host. Oh, yeah. I'm not the host. You're the host. You do it. I do it? Yeah, you can do it. Oh, I'm so empowered. Right now.